Niliwaambia hii siasa msiweke kwa roho. Mambo ya siasa ni kama upepo. Inaweza panda, inaweza shuka, inaweza simama. Na mumeona tayari yule hiyo maneno nimeanza kuzunguka. Ama mmejaona? Simeona? Ilianza 2014 ama ilikuwa sijui wapi handshake kakuja. Watu wengine karibu wapandishe pressure. Sasa tumeenda kwa hii siasa, tumeenda, tumeenda, tumeenda. Unaona sasa mudabadi watangula wako kwa bottom up wanatanga tanga. Lakini hapo nyuma Musadi na mudabadi watangula walikuwa kwa na gani? Wewe endelea kuhangaika hapa Eldoret. <laughs> Watu watakutana na nani wacho hapo kwa roundabout. Ukipiga kelele. I'm telling you I am not the most experienced politician. Lakini kwa hii muda kidogo mmenipatia nafasi. Nimeona mambo mengi sana kwa siasa. Na kuna mambo mnaona hapa kwa TV mbele, lakini ile mambo iko nyuma ya TV ni mingi kuliko iko mbele kwa TV. Hata mkiona watu wakikwambana huko. Jioni unasikia mtu anapigwa simu si ukuje dina. Na atakuja na umejana ile mambo ilikuwa inaendelea kwa TV mbele ni tofauti. Usiku unasikia mtu anaambia my wife ametengeneza dina na wewe unashikwa na pressure hapa. Waachane na hiyo maneno. Be peaceful. Sawa sawa. Ile tumeamua kama kaunti ya wasingishu kama viongozi na mimi kama governor wa hapa. Kila mtu kaunti hii ako na uhuru kumpigia kura ule mtu anataka. Kura si lazima. Kura ni kupembeleza na kuomba. Ama namna gani? Eh sasa wewe piga kura mahali unataka lakini waacha fujo tuweze kukaa kwa pamoja sisi tutaomba kura kura hapa 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 wengine watapigia sisi wengine watapigia na kuna msemo katika kalenjin kama unaomba kura na unataka kupata 100% sisi huwa tunasema ukiona watu wote wanakupenda umekufa ukiona kuna mtu anasema hii mtu ni mbaya umeisha lakini kama bado uko na 30% wanasema hii manda kwa hii kisirani hii. Hii mtu atutaki. 60% wanasema si mbaya sana bado unaishi. Kwa hivyo hata hii maneno ya kura hakuna watu watakupigia kura 100%. Na ukipigiwa 100% utaenda kulala huko. Hata utaenda kusahau kuna kazi ulikuwa umepewa. Kwa hivyo tumesema kila mtu hapa hako na uhuru ya kupiga kura mahali anataka. Kila mtu hako na uhuru ya kuja kuomba kura hapa vile unataka na mimi napongeza watu ya kaunti hii mumetupa heshima sana kwa vile wanasiasa wengi wamekuja kuomba kura hapa hakuna mtu amepigiwa kelele Raila alikuja hapa kuomba kura akahama William Ruto akakuja ngawa ni mwenyewe pia akaomba kura akahama tunaongojea wengine wakuje wa lakini ile tumesema sasa si mumenipatia rusa niambie watu wapime waweke maneno wa kichungi wakifika Timborua. Ama mmesemaje? Hapa sasa tunataka ile siasa ya maturity. Siasa ya sera. Siasa ya kuomba kura. Hapana maneno ya watu kuja kuleta matusi ama uchochezi. Hiyo sisi kama kaunti tumekataa. Na tutasimama hapo. Kwa sababu baada ya uchaguzi sisi tunataka kuendelea kuishi hapa, tunataka kuendelea kufanya biashara, wengine bado wanaendelea kufanya ukulima na mambo mengine yote waweze kufanya ile mimi nafurahia wananchi wameanza kujua sasa ya kuwa hata ukingangana sana si atutaletewa ugali na sani mpya kwa mlango bado utakata jasho ndio ukule mimi naona hiyo mmeanza kushika network mmeanza kujua kumbe hii watu tunaweza pigia kura pia na wahame na warudi baada ya mwaka tano mimi nafurahia vile naona Kenyan public generally are beginning to realize that really they should not invest all their hopes in life on a politician or government. Actually, you must invest yourself and think of how you can do something. Kasi ya serikali ni kupweka tuli environment na esafanya wewe ufanya kasi. A conducive environment to do business, to do farming, to study, to innovate, is what government can provide but the rest you must work out as a citizen so it is not a matter of life and death 
Nasema tujue kuna future, kuna kuishi kesho. So mimi na waoma iko mama wengi wanatafuta viti. Na nilienda mkutano mwingine nikasia wamama wale wanatafuta viti wanafunzwa na wamama wengine. Nikasia mama mwingine anamwambia usitishwe hata mzee asikukatase sijui nini nini. Nikamwambia nyinyi mtavunja maboma ya watu. Eh? Na nikawaambia it is possible to be a woman of integrity, a family woman and be a leader. Na nikawapa mfano kama ya mbunge aliyekuwa mbunge wa Dagoridi mheshimiwa mama Beth Mugo. Kwa sababu alikuwa landlord yangu zamani. Huyo mama ni mama ya shujaa. Anayetoka kwake naenda bunge. Akimaza bunge napitia kwa ofisi ya mzee wanakuja nyumbani. Hiyo ni family na ni leader. Hata wengine wanaenda kufunza kina mama tu na sawaja mzee ndio uende siasa. Na siasa usipopata kiti. Utaenda wapi? Eh? So those are the kind of things we must take charge in the community so that we align our people correctly. What was appear with the wrong information? Eh? Alafu kesho watu waja na hasara. And I'm very proud of Beth Mugo in her conduct as a leader. And I'm telling you do research. Fanya utabiti uone. We want leaders like that. And that is why I'm telling you it is possible to have politicians who are disciplined, who are measured, who can take this country far because they think of the future and know themselves. So inawezekana. Na itawezekana nyinyi mkichukua hiyo wajibu. Nyinyi mkitake charge kwa ground. Sasa tutaanza kupata watu wengi ambao wanafikiria sana future ya Kenya.